what is up guys it's so bash we are back again today with an update yes first update of 2016 and it looks like it is going to be released on valentine's day which is what february 14th something like that and there's a lot coming out they gave us a little sneak peek of it but we're gonna dig into it and i'm gonna show you more of a bulk of what we're gonna be looking at in this update now the main new feature in this update is going to be basically the character equivalent to what the pet enhancement system is and that is called the hero enhancement system uh, basically what this is characters will be able to get new skins and new attributes with this um, it's going to be tied together with things called talismans now there are two different talismans uh, one is the fairy guardian it looks pretty weird but yeah it's right here and also we have of course the uh, scroll these are the two that are coming out with this update uh, as far as I know these two uh, they're going to add more in the future but these two are going to do two things uh, the fairy guardian is going to be an attack attribute and the scroll is going to be more of a defensive attribute to your character um, and you upgrade the stats on your character which adds to your combat skills um, but you have to do the hero enhancements first so you take a look at that you're going to be looking at updating not just the skill you're going to be adding more attributes to a certain skill through these runes that are coming out now these runes uh, I'm not exactly sure what stats are going to be on these runes but you are going to be able to add them to each individual skill that you already have now on top of those skills I've also heard there's going to be six new attributes that are going to be coming with this update now the translation from Chinese to English was a kind of loosely translated and what I got out of it for these attributes were going to be power cruelty anger agility stamina and physical now once it does get translated and does come out some of that might change but as you can see here you have a new page you're gonna have six new attributes that you can level up uh, they're more along the lines of magical stuff uh, but once we get in more information on that we will let you know and of course with the update Valentine's Day you're gonna get a new outfit I'm not sure what the outfit is gonna consist of yet but if we can get our hands on some juicy stats on that I hope they do have something nice on it um, and next we want to look at the pets that they're going to be introducing and changing in this update um, they're gonna add new enhancement skills to four pets that we already have which is jib jab master shoe pyrotar and ice turtle personally i don't use any of these right now but you know if they're good enough i might level them up and start trying them out and last but not least i want you i want to introduce you to the last pet that is going to be coming out here uh, this is him right here and we're gonna look at his skills uh, which I loosely translated to English as well uh, so bear with me if some of this sounds a little bit crazy but the first skill he charges and slashes the enemy for hundred and seventy percent damage the second skill charges after sliding a short distance that causes four hundred and fifty percent damage which also has a three second buff that has a forty percent reduction to it I'm not specifically sure on what the reduction is. Uh, the third skill, it jumps forward causing 450% damage and summons something. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, if, the enemy was at, if the enemy is within 5 meters, it has a 3 second penalty effect. Uh, it said something about total damage during lightning by 50%. Uh, that one was one of the ones that I wasn't positive about uh, for the second part of it. The fourth skill, which is the rare skill, uh, forms a perimeter around you for three seconds plus pet evolution times 0.3 seconds uh, that you can't be harmed. Uh, I'm assuming that just basically makes you immune for a certain amount of time. Uh, 
It's just a guess. Uh, I'm not specifically sure on that one. And as you can see here, when the pet does come out, yes, it already does have the enhancement option. Uh, those skills are going to be increases damage by 50% for three seconds. Uh, and it said the initial was 5% and increases by 5% per level after that. Uh, and on that skill, those do have stat enhancements. Uh, these are the skills that you have to have the solar nucleus to level up. On that one, the stat enhancements are going to be a hit rate by 4%, uh, increases hit points by 3,000, and increases crit rate by 2%. And on the second uh, enhanced skill, um, this one was kind of iffy as well. After using this skill, the pet will be immune to control effects for the initial level of 3.2 seconds. Each level after that increases it by 0 .02 seconds. So another eighth of a second. Um, and during the rare skill, this is the other part of this skill, um, was kind of confusing, but during the rare skill, player's attack hits 33%. And it's a chance to make enemy units by 80% treatment effect within five seconds. And it said the initial is 16% and it's 16% per level after you level it up. Uh, my guess on that is uh, during that rare skill in use, uh, it increases player hit by 16% initially and then, then it's increased by 16% after you level it up per level. Um, that's my guess on that. Uh, but this is a very rare first look at what we're gonna have in just shy of a month um, let me know what you guys think about this and uh, we're gonna go from there once we get more information on some of this stuff I will be releasing it to you guys and of course snail does have some of this stuff on their Facebook page and they will be releasing more information about it over the next coming weeks until it is released um, but that is going to be it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Solbash. You guys have a nice day.